Next question. Tangents to the hyperbola x square by l square minus y square by v square equal to 1. Make angles theta 1, theta 2 with its transverse axis of the hyperbola. Show that the point of intersection of these tangents lies on the curve 2xy equal to k into x square minus a square when tan theta 1 plus tan theta 2 equal to k. First here, hyperbola equation you have to take. Given equation of hyperbola. x square by a square minus y square by b square equal to 1. Here we are discussing about the angles and tangents. So, the equation of tangent with slope m with slope m to equation 1 is y is equal to mx plus or minus root of a square m square minus b square. This is the formula for equation of tangent to the hyperbola with slope m. mx we can take this side that the first point of intersection we have to calculate. Let the point of intersection let the point of intersection of tangents b p of x1 comma y1 and it lies on and it lies on y is equal to equation 2 simply therefore it will becomes y1 equal to mx1 plus or minus root of a square m square minus b square mx1 we can take this side y1 minus mx1 is equal to plus or minus root of a square m square minus b square squaring on both sides y1 square plus m square x1 square minus 2 m x1 y1 which is equal to plus or minus will become plus a square m square minus b square after that m square a square m square minus b square also we are taking this side and write directly m square I am taking common here from here and here x1 square a square m square you can take this side minus a square after that m m into minus 2 x1 y1 and the rest of the terms plus y1 square minus b square you can take this side plus b square equal to 0 equation number 3 equation 3 represents a quadratic equation equation 3 represents a quadratic equation in m then it has two roots then it has two roots m1 comma m2 respectively denotes the slopes of two tangents which make angles which make angles theta 1 theta 2 with its transverse axis that is m1 equal to tan theta 1 m2 equal to tan theta 2 after that sum of the slopes m1 m2 m1 plus m2 minus b by a this you have to compare with a m square plus b m plus c a value is this one b value is this one and c value is this one minus b by a means minus of minus 2 x1 y1 divided by x1 square minus a square and product of the roots m1 m2 equal to c by a this is c value this is a value y1 square plus b square divided by x1 square minus a square m1 plus m2 equal to minus of minus will become plus 2x1 y1 divided by x1 square minus a square now after completing of this step come to the given condition given condition 
tan theta 1 plus tan theta 2 is equal to k tan theta 1 plus tan theta 2 means it is indirectly m1 plus m2 is equal to k we know the value of m1 plus m2 here 2x1 y1 divided by x1 square minus a square equal to k cross multiplying 2x1 y1 equal to k into x1 square minus a square the locus of point of intersection the locus of point of intersection P of x1 comma y1 is whenever you are writing locus you remove x1 y1 and keep x comma y that is 2xy equal to k into x square minus a square the next question which is related to the previous question prove that the point of intersection of two perpendicular tangents to the hyperbola lies on the circle. This circle is called direct class circle to the hyperbola equation. First, like in previous problem, same steps we have to follow. Given equation of hyperbola, x square by a square minus y square by b square equal to 1. The equation of tangent the slope here to the equation 1 is y equal to mx plus r minus a square m square minus b square. And let consider that point of intersection of tangents be p of x1 y1 and it lies on the equation 2. So y1 equal to mx1 plus r minus root of a square m square minus b square. mx1 we can take this side squaring on both sides. a minus b whole square expansion a square plus b square minus 2ab equal to plus r minus whole square root of plus a square m square minus b square. This a square m square minus b square value we are taking this side. And from these two terms, I am taking common m square, and the rest of the terms is m square into x1 square minus a square plus m into minus 2x1 by 1 plus y1 square minus x square, b square into x square plus b square equal to 0. Equation 3 represents a quadratic equation in m, then it has two roots m1 and m2 respectively, denotes the slopes of two tangents which makes angles theta 1, theta 2 with its transverse axis. That means m1 equal to tan theta 1 and m2 equal to tan theta 2. Here also sum of the roots and product of the roots we have to write it. But according to the given question, two perpendicular tangents, here we have to write that concept. Since the tangents are perpendicular, since the tangents are perpendicular, in examination you have to underline it based on this concept perpendicular then we have m1 m2 equal to minus 1 product of two slopes equal to minus 1 what is the value of m1 m2 here this one y1 square plus b square divided by x1 square minus a square equal to minus 1 cross multiplying y1 square plus b square equal to minus 1 into this value minus x1 square plus a square minus x1 square you can take this side b square we are taking this side x1 square plus y1 square equal to a square minus b square therefore the point of intersection lies on a circle x square plus y square equal to a square minus b square 